what's going on everyone welcome back to cruising the south and if you're new to the channel a big welcome here cruising the south we share with you guys all the awesome places we go with the boat but also all the problems solutions services and maintenance we go through and uh today's just a quick video i wanted to make this video because uh i got asked this question that I actually get asked a lot right like what does these do how do you drive a twin screw engine i mean a twin screw boat right and I got this asked so many times, so I'm gonna make a quick video about it. You know, there's a thumb rule about it that it actually, it helps a lot. You know, even like uh, me as even experienced boater, like, you know, if you get thrown a spot where, you know, like you need to act quick, or if you get, uh, you know, like most case, like people can panic and knowing this will help you, you know? Like per se, what I usually like to look at is the thumb rule, okay? Because uh, this is my um, my shifter, okay? I put the bolt, you know, each engine forward and reverse here. And then, of course, I have my throttle over here. So, uh, what I, why I call it the thumb rule is because, you know, if you were to think, uh, driving the, when you put your both hands on, uh, you know, your, your, your starboard and your port side, if you were to think like as your thumb, your, your thumb, your, your thumb sticking out. So like if you were to think, if I put this handle forward, the front of the boat's gonna wanna go that way, okay? Now, if I put this, if I put this one in reverse, back of the boat's gonna wanna go that way. Now, same thing to the other side, okay? If I put, if I put this one forward, the boat's gonna wanna go that way. Now, if I put this one in reverse, the boat's gonna, the, uh, the, uh, the back of the boat is gonna wanna go that way. So, you know, if you were to, just think, you know, so like forward that way, reverse this way, same thing with this one, you know, forward that way, and then reverse would be this way. So, you know, quite easy to remember, forward that way, re reverse that way, forward that way, reverse this way. And of course you would throttle as much as you would need on that case. And I guess on the driving a trailer too, I have a little trick. Okay, so like when you're backing up a trailer, if you are to put your hand on the bottom of the steering wheel, then you turn the steering for whatever side you want the trailer to go, okay? As long as you're holding on the bottom of the steering wheel, if you want the trailer to go that way, you will turn that way. And if you want the the, the, the trailer to go that way, you will turn this way. So it kind of takes the guessing out of it, you know? So I like to look at things that way. And um, so, you know, my friend, uh, you know, thought it was quite interesting. So I figured I would just make a quick video about it. So, and thank you everyone for all the love, you know, like I know a lot of people are was following my engine replacement and um, I guess I was able to help and answer a lot of questions. And uh, not that I am a professional or anything like that, but you know, I, I mean, I do keep my boat maintained and I have the basics and I do a lot, a lot of research. So by watching my video, you're kind of skipping a lot of research that I have done, you know? And uh, one of the next videos that are gonna come up would be like, I wanna compare my both engines. Like I said before, one engine is fresh water cooled, one engine is uh, uh, raw water cooled. I wanna make measurements and see what's the difference between the two. And uh, I guess I'm gonna have to learn some fiberglass too because I had my seat break on me. I don't know if you can see right there, see like it's a, such a big span on the seat and it cracked right there. So I guess I am going to have to learn to do some fiberglass. But I want to do it with gel coat and not with all grip. I wanted to put the same thing that is here. So uh, that would be quite interesting, you know? So uh, thank you everyone for watching the video. And I see you guys on the very next episode. Bye-bye.